Come in, Crypto! Are you receiving? The mothership has been destroyed! You must come to my aid immediately! Follow the distressed beacon to my location! from outer space. When pigs... Guess I better cut back on the railway. Drop the cop, asshole! Is someone there? Amuse thy languid Furon god, and stab my idol with bolts of electricity. Attend the holy syllables of the great Arkvudel. My waning joie de vivre is rekindled. Landing zone activated. No sweat. It needs to be aired out every 5,000 parsecs or so. I need to bring in some big guns. Uh, know where I can get my hands on some? 
I did manage to jettison some data cores before the mothership was hit. You might be able to recover some weapons from them, if you can find any. But it certainly won't be easy. Okay, so, where are the data cores? That's just it! They could have entered the atmosphere at any time, in any place, and therefore landed anywhere on the planet. I've managed to locate only one. It was ejected after my holopox unit, so it landed quite nearby. Well, I guess there's nothing left to do but scout the area and find that data core. near your position. I'll slap it up on your radar. I don't understand it. We blew that alien spacecraft out of the sky, and yet the shriveled geriatric one somehow survived. This Jopas must be harder to kill than we thought. I spit on them! Nonetheless, inform the Kremlin we shall proceed with the operation as planned. Tell them we need as much revelate as they can ship, as quickly as they can ship it. Da, Agent Orincho. And our American distributor? He suspects nothing. In fact, he seemed quite enthusiastic about the whole idea. He thinks he'll be spreading revolution in a paper cup. And so he will. But not, I think, the sort he expects. Idealists. They spit on them! Pleh! Stalin, he understood. Ideas may start revolutions, but guns and gulags finish them. Well, no matter. Soon the citizens of Bay City will be embarking on a very bad trip. <laughs>
Jeez, Pox, my head's still spinning. What the hell's going on around here? Why are those Ruskies gunning for us? Frankly, I'm more concerned with how the KGB managed such a successful twin strike. They're not usually so organized. We need to find them, Crypto, before they spring any more surprises. Okay, so what? I just start knocking on doors and doing the slicing dice? You do not. The KGB are hardly likely to hang around if you just start indiscriminately blowing away humans. Yeah, well, I was just brainstorming. Well, stop. I've done a little research in the criminal files of the local constabulary. Apparently, there's one informant in Bay City who always knows what's going down on the streets. They call him the Freak. The Freak, huh? Yeah, I've heard about him. Cat's got connections all over town. He's kind of a burnout, though. From what I hear, he doesn't even need drugs anymore. He lives in his own personal mental lava lamp. But if any of those stinky monkeys knows what the KGB are up to, I bet he does. Then I suggest you locate him and find out what he knows. All right, enough chit-chat. I'm off to find our little hippie friend, the freak. Excellent. I shall continue my repairs on the saucer. And then, I don't know, order a virtual pizza or something. Brains, I hate this. And that's why I won't drop acid. Okay, nice. nobody take the yellow ones. They are seriously bad. Wait a minute. You ain't one of us. Doesn't matter what you wear, just as long as you're there. The Freak is supplying the whole damn commune at the park, and yet he still can't get any action. What a loser. Hey there, uh, Moon Doggy. Uh, I'm looking for a dude with his ear to the street. The kids call him the Freak. You found him? But I'm all tapped out, man. The heat's coming down on me, you know. Try me next week.
Well, what I need is information. What do you know about the Ivans in the cheap suits who crashed our party? You mean those KGB cats? Yeah, those dudes are straight, all right. They make Jack Lord look like Abby Hoffman. Only they didn't crash, man. They were invited. Who invited the KGB to uh, harsh our buzz? From what I hear, it was that cat who leads the commune. I don't know his real name, but he calls himself Coyote Bongwater, which is pretty righteous. Supposedly, he's like this master of tantric meditation and spiritual healing. All I know is Cat's got the chicks eaten out of his hookah. Okay, you piqued my interest. Where do I find Coyote Bong Water? Well, from what I hear, he's kind of paranoid. He doesn't hang out at the park for long. I heard he's got a pad someplace, but I don't know where. Dude's been handing out this new turn on a drink like in a in a can. He calls it if you want him, that's your in. Find some revelate and you'll probably find coyote bong water. What's in this revelade stuff? He claims it's like an all-natural elixir that enhances your cosmic awareness, sir. Bongwater says it's the first shot in the global revolution against the man. Great. Great. Like the monkeys aren't revolting enough already. Thanks, Freak. I gotta go find Coyote Bongwater. I can't believe I just said that. Coyote Bongwater's handing out Revel Aid at the apartment building on Hashbury Street? What am I waiting for? Mama's working up a powerful thirst! Your wish is my command. Right on. You're the man, man. Just call me Genie, Major. Sid Barrett was right. Ain't everybody's Ooh, getting in bed except that. Mama Cass. What do you know? The kids are all right. Look out for out here. Came from outer space. Run for your life. Right on. And that's why I won't drop back. Last 
Now see, that's just wrong. Open the pod bay Look, doors, Hal. It's John Glenn. Jeez, Box, my head still sp what? Frank. Okay. F find it, then we'll. is my command. Very deep. I just want to bask in his presence. I won't make a peep. You heard me. Go drink refreshing revelry. You come back later. Next week, we'll start one-on-one -on -one Shakti tutoring. I'll be giving each of you private, hands-on instruction in Kriyanish Pati, the highest state of tantric arousal. These sessions can run ten hours. So eat a good breakfast. <gasps> That's it for today. Remember, wherever you go, I'll be there. The shine in your Japan, the sparkle in your China. Bodhisattva, Bodhisattva. Nah! God damn flashbacks. Guess again, sunshine. Nice little setup. Guns, cheap Russian booze, teenage bra burning hippie chicks. Man after my own heart, if I had one. <laughs> Endure electricity. Look at me.
shit is seriously messed up. That again, you lose an eye. Capiche? I feel so fuzzy. <laughs> We got him. 10-4, all units stand down. Here, freaky, freaky, freaky. How's it hanging, freak? Uh, listen, I need a little more info. All right, but hurry it up, will ya? You're making me nervous. Here's the thing. I found Bongwater, but he got away before I could ice him. Whoa. I don't know, man. You didn't tell me you were gonna get violent. You didn't ask. Smart hippie. Okay, okay. Maybe I've... Heard some things? He's gone underground and come up with a new plan to distribute his revelade. Okay, so where's Bongwater hiding? Nobody knows, man. He just sends his goons out to spread the revelade. Just like a snake hiding in the grass. But he can't hide forever. I got a couple of pretty good weed whackers of my own. Great. What's that wacko up to now? Get this. Somehow he got his hands on a whole bunch of blimps. Blimps? What's he gonna do? Start a tire company? It's not what's on the outside, man. It's what's on the inside. He's gonna gas the whole city with revelade. Wow. That's so wild, it might just work. Well, I'll tell you this. Bongwater's been drinking his own Revelade if he thinks his scheme's gonna work. Whatever. Hey, you coming to Jade's party? What? No, I'm gonna blow up Bongwater's blimps full of Revelade. Didn't you hear me? Easy, man. Move out. What am I doing talking to this creep?
Pox, we got a situation here. Bongwater must be drinking his own product. The freak says he's planning to fumigate Bay City with giant blimps full of Revelade gas. Great galaxies! That's so moronic, it just might work. Luckily, I've detected more data calls from the mothership nearby, containing repair parts you can use to get the saucer up and flying. Once you're in the air, you can blow up blimps to your heart's content. Gotcha. I'll snatch up those repair pods and swing back to the saucer. Oh, yeah. It's payback time. Don't make me shoot you. Move! Shouldn't eat that last one. Almost got him. I love. Ten one oh eight. Send back up. Oh. Ah! Can't we talk about this? Oh, Pussy. can't get a clear shot. This is what I get. So close, yet so far. Scramble the fighter jet! And that's why I won't drop ass. Right on! Time to boogie!
shell sitting in your pockets. That will help upgrade your weapons. Get to the saucer, Crypto, and put your hands on some serious firepower! Just tell me where bong water is when you're packing a new Ferrari. You don't want it gathering dust in the garage. Not really. And bong water? What can I say, man? Nobody's seen the dude. Well, nobody's at Prudence, I guess. Who's Prudence? Ah, dear Prudence. No, she's Bongwater's new protege. Anybody knows where bong water's at? It'd be prudence. He sounds like a real firecracker. All right, 
I'm off to introduce myself to Prudence, see if I can convince her to give up bong water. I wonder if Prudence is still out at the park. Man, she makes my head swim. Even when I'm not stoned. I'd be ashamed of Prudence Kane if she were my daughter. Giving up a house in Sausage Lido for the park? Her parents must be... I hope Prudence isn't at the park again. If I were in a pacifist, I'd kick her stuck-up rich girl ass! came, snaps her fingers, and we're all supposed to come running to hear her big announcement. Coyote Bongwa Nicholson is so foxy. Hmm, if only I could find a guy who talks like him. Prudence came, snaps her fingers, and we're all supposed to come running to hear her big announcement. Coyote Bongwa Che Guevara is so foxy. If only I could wear him on a t-shirt.
Bong's cane isn't nearly good enough for Coyote Bong water. She's nothing but a bourgeois dilettante. If she gets up on that stage, I might just rip her. Soon the Revelade trucks are going to reach the fort, and Coyote Bong water's going to turn this whole town into one big happy commune. Brothers and sisters, children of the revolution, this is the dawning of the age of aquariums. My name is Prudent Kane. Like me, many of you joined the American Liberation Front as a way of getting back at your rich suburban parents for subjecting you to an adolescence of obscene luxury. Look, Princess, we ain't here for the opening act. Where's Coyote Bongwater? Sadly, our leader, Coyote Bongwater, cannot be with us today because he is setting in motion a grand design to transform this entire city into a countercultural utopia. Bay City is about to become one big happy commune. Suck on that, Daddy. All right, so what's Bongwater up to this time? So how can Coyote Bongwater possibly free the minds of a whole city? The same way he freed our minds. With Revelade! How did I know that was coming? Revelade sounds yummy to the tummy. So uh, where do I get me some? and sisters are about to deliver the final batch of Revelade to our leader, Coyote Bongwater. He's gonna pour it into the bay. Soon the masses are gonna be begging us to lead them in revolution. Those Revelade trucks could be a serious pain in my ass, and I haven't blown anything up for at least 10 minutes. of this land offends mine all-seeing eye. Read the vicinity of human-made refuse. Thus spake Arkboodle. The desecration of this land offends mine all-seeing eye. Read the vicinity of human-made refuse. Thus spake Arkboodle.
Just call me Genie, Major. A good villain always has an underground lair. On a totally unrelated it. subject, I wonder where Coyote Bongwaters live in these days. Look at them. They've all been experienced. Well, I haven't. The Russians have landed! Oakland. Right on. And that's... Why I won't drop acid. Drugged out flower child here. Who wants a piece? Hold me closer, tiny dancer. I'm. I could have sworn I heard Bongwater chanting in the underpass under the hill. I gotta lay off the cheese puffs. A personal session of spiritual and physical healing with the groovy bomb water himself. It's like winning the karmic lottery. Now if I can just find the secret entrance to his inner sanctum, I can finally get my chakras adjusted, if you know what I mean. A good villain always has an underground lair. On a totally unrelated subject, I wonder where Coyote bomb waters live in these days. Yeah, I guess I had to destroy my mind in order to save it. Could have sworn I heard Bongwater chanting in the underpass under the hill. I gotta lay off the cheese puff. Hey, why shouldn't students run the world? Worked in Russia! A good villain always has an underground lair. On a totally unrelated subject, I wonder where Coyote Bongwaters live in these days. Who puts a Church of Enlightenment underground? It's like meditating in the underworld. Bongwater ought to spruce the place up a little. I could have sworn I heard Bongwaters chanting in the underground. for everybody, the man. I gotta lay off the cheese puffs. A good villain always has an underground lair. On a totally unrelated subject, I wonder where Coyote Bongwaters live in these days. Nothing is real and nothing to get hung about. The chicks say Bongwater lives inside the old fort, but you never see him up on the hill. Where? What is he, a Morlock? I could have sworn I heard Bongwater chanting in the underpass under the hill. I gotta lay off the cheese puffs. That Bongwater needs to work on his tan. It's like he spends most of his days... Stupid beetles. Elvis could kick your asses.
The chicks say Bongwater lives inside the old fort, but you never see him up on the hill. Weird. What is he, a Morlock? That Bongwater needs to work on his tan. It's like he spends most of his days underground or something. Man, these hands are getting clumsy. A good villain always has an underground lair. On a totally unrelated subject, I wonder where Coyote Bongwater's living these days. The chicks say Bongwater lives inside the old fort, but you never see him up on the hill. Weird. What is he, a Morlock? Back off, dirtbag. Seriously, that's the... Run for your... 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 Run 
from me. Move it or lose it, Agent Orangeoff, come in. Uh, I failed. You'll have to start the revolution without me. Yet. Yet? B but. This city is useless to us now. I mean, have you? 
Have you seen these people? They make the students in Prague look like a meeting of the Politburo. We shall destroy this degenerate city and return to the Soviet Union with the spacecraft fragments we have managed to retrieve. But, but what about freeing America from the tyranny of capitalist consumerism? Do not despair, comrade. The party will long remember your efforts to cripple your decadent nation. You shall not have died in vain. Or in Chovalt. But... No! No! I wanted to save America, not destroy it! Oh, man! What have I done?! Sometimes it's kinder just to put them down. I've spotted a weapon data core near your position. I'll slap it up on your radar. Crap! He vaporized them! Crypto fascist! I 
Just call me Genie, Major.